I just thought this was pretty, you know. I mean, you're still a center to sandwich between houses, but at least you got a little bit of room and, uh, you know, it uh, gives you that foresty feel and especially with the leaves coming in on the trees and the sunlight glistening through, it's, uh, and the creek over here. Oh, very nice, very nice hike. Uh, I won't take any more video until I see something unique again, but I just wanted to get you, get you the look and feel here. So this is nice. I mean, we're transitioning into uh, more of a pine forest. Look at the size of these pine trees. Let's, let me just get the scale. <laughs> I mean, they're ginormous, you know. That's beautiful. That is beautiful that they've got this preserved. And you see how the trails just kind of kind of wind on around. And uh, this is really, really cool. Nice transition. Lots of people out today, man. Here comes another guy jogging. All right, let's just keep going. Well, if I feel like it, maybe we'll go up here, these stairs on the way back. You can see there looks, it looks like there's a sidewalk along the top up there. Uh, it doesn't say on the post what's... Uh, Looks like those are, might be apartments back here. I don't know, but I, we're transitioning out of the uh, pine trees and into you know this right here. So uh, that's pretty cool. I don't know what, well, I gotta go up there and find out. What, well, I guess we're gonna, kinda looks like we're gonna start going up down here. Let's see what we see. All right, I think I know where we are. That's, I believe that's gonna be the lake up there because you can see the water pouring out right here from the, from that's gotta be the lake up there. And then uh, this must be the other, the other trail that uh, that we saw on the sign. Let's see what it says. It says White Creek. Uh, well, straight ahead. I'm trying to get what it says going that way. Uh, anyway, I, I don't know what this trail is. It doesn't really say. Uh, well, I guess it's considered part of the Greenway is to go this way. Well, we'll do that. We got all day. Although my knee's starting to hurt. I, three days of hiking, man, I'm, I'm feeling it. I want to get up here and look at the lake. And, uh, and then of course I want to see the park and uh, maybe we'll come back and do, do this right here. I don't know how far that goes though. All right, let's keep going. You can see lots of people out. So we are at the lake and that does look like a, boy, what a town is to live in right back there. And there is a dock there. I don't know, we're just going to walk around here, but. You know, here's, here's a, you know, when, every time I see things like this, it doesn't make any sense. Why are they cutting this whole area? I mean, can you imagine the amount of gas it takes? I mean, I guess it would be good for maybe flying a plane in or playing flag football, but it's not very level. You know, what's the point? I would just let it grow in naturally. And I mean, I don't know. I mean, I, I, I have no idea. But I, I think you could just come here and spend a day at this park and just hike around. Um, it looks like there's a place down here to put your, your bikes. Uh, I guess, and then we'll, we'll, uh, we'll hike out up, up the lake right here. I don't know, I don't see a trail on the other side. It'd be nice if they had a trail that went all the way around the lake, but I, I, I'm not sure they do. But let's, uh, let's just hike around and see what we see. So I'll have to find out what a metro park is here in, uh, in the town of Cary, because we used to have these up in Michigan, and it was a completely separate entity from the state parks. But I thought I'd get the sign here. Uh, so look, you do have uh, some ball fields. I'm trying to see, what's, well, here we are right here. Okay, and then, uh, well, here's Bond Lake right here. Uh, and then of course, look at here, you got the Oxford Hunt Greenway. Well, it looks, of course, oh, they do have a lake trail well, over here. Okay, that's, that's on the other side of the lake. So uh, yeah, maybe we can we can get over here. Although that's, boy, I tell you, I'm getting tired. I got to get back at some point. Uh, and then look at the fish you can catch in that lake, man. Oh my gosh, largemouth bass. Uh, they got to have smallmouth bass in there. I don't see that listed. Yellow perch, uh, warmouth, uh, black crappie. Oh, those are good eating, man. I'll tell you what, man. If you bring your fishing pole and come here to. Bond Lake, what the heck? And then of course, look at here. I mean, like I said, oh, don't want to get a face on the video here, but uh, you can look at this. Uh, you, like I said, you just come here and hike around in a little picnic area. People throwing Frisbee here. Um, <laughs> hey, so I'm gonna hike up here and look at these because you know what? I, this is my stupidity, okay? I, my uh, buddy had an orange and I was thinking I was Well, I wanted to get this on the video. 
But over here's a trail. Look at a kid tumbling down the... <laughs> you remember when you used to do that? Get dizzy as hell. Oh, bad. Don't want to get his face on the video, but uh, you can see the trail goes on this way. I, you could spend a whole day at this park and just just hang out, you know. I mean, I'm not going to do that. I, I, I got to hike all the way back. It was a pretty significant hike getting here. Uh, I'm on my second battery here on the GoPro. I mean, that's, that, that took a lot of video, so this is going to be a four or five video set uh, going up to show you the Cary uh, Greenway. Um, but you can see right here, here's the parking lot. And I'm going to, that says it's the uh, Bond Park Community Center. Let's go over and take a look at that. Uh, might as well just get, because I don't have to walk very far. Like I said, you, I, I bet I could do a whole day long video at this park. Uh, so I'm not going to, I'm going to just kind of mosey around. I'm, I'm actually in search of the bathrooms at this point. <laughs> you know, so when I find them. But you look over here, this might even be another trail going up into the woods right here. Or it says Greenway. Uh, maybe that's, uh, it's continuing on this way. Maybe it just goes over to the community center. Let's, let's, let's find out. So here's what I'm talking about. This is called the Paw 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 Trail, Pine Cone Trail. Like I said, I mean you could literally look, well look at here. There's some push-up bars. I maybe I should I'll do a couple push-ups. Uh, that's good. And so maybe this is I bet this might be a little obstacle course. Oh man, that'd be awesome. I love uh, obstacle courses because uh, you know look you can get you know. Cause I'm an old fart, man. I can't push up off the ground. I, I need a little help, and that just—that's uh, exactly what that is. That's for push-ups, um, and then, uh, or that's what I use it for. I don't know, but I bet if you hike around this trail, there's probably some other stations along the way. I was just trying to get over to the community center, but I just wanted to show you. I don't think I'll get back here, but uh, I mean, it, this park would be—it'd uh, be an all-day video, I think. So I met a woman back there, and uh, evidently there's a whole series of trails back here. Uh, she told me that you can go off to the right up here, and that'll take you around to the boathouse, and or you can go left, and this will take you around to the parking lot, and you know. So I, I imagine you could, like I said, you could spend the whole day at this park, you know. Maybe not necessarily hiking, have a picnic, you know. God, I'd love to bring a fishing pole. But we're gonna go off to the left here and just get to the community house, clubhouse because this is gonna loop around to the parking lot. And uh, it does look like this is a, an obstacle course. I don't even know what this is. That's the first time I've ever seen anything like that. I don't know, well, let's see what the sign says. What do you suppose? I mean, I got some sort of exercise, I guess. Let's see what it says. Oh, balance board. Well, that's cool. I've never seen one of these. On all my days of going through obstacle courses in various places, that'd be fun. I'm too tired to try it right now. <laughs> you, know, you know, I've been hiking, but you can see this. Here's the trail that I guess goes back to the boathouse. Um, I think this, this, here's another trail. I think that would just take you up to, it looks like there's a road up there that connects to that road. I see some cars rolling by there. And then, uh, and then this this trail, I guess, will take you just around to the. That's the Paw Creek Trail, and then I'm just going to take this little side trail and get to the community center. And you know what I'm looking for. All right, and then uh, we'll uh, we'll hike over to the other side of the lake, and that'll be it. And uh, then I'm going to hike back. Uh, it's a, it's been a long day. I'll be tired tonight, and looking looking forward to the game. Now we got uh, got the NCAA finals, baby. Not that I'm really care about either team but you know at least you got to watch the NCAA finals when you if you can especially on a 75 inch tv it's going to be quite uh quite fun bye bye all right anybody watching this video you tell me what this is it looks like it's some sort of ramp for a vehicle to get up on or maybe like a lawnmower or something it's not very wide right there but then what do you do with it it's not high enough to I don't know it's got the cones around and everything Anyway, I'm trying to track the community center here. I'll let you know what I find out. So I'm in the community center bathroom. By the way, there's basically just two basketball courts and then a kid's play area in here. Look how many stalls they got. <laughs> Maybe they got some big events here. And then you do have showers here, which is kind of nice. And then a little, uh, little locker room. Um, so if you did come here on a hot summer day, you could come in here and get you a shower, I suppose. I don't know if it's... You have to be a member of something or anything like that. Nobody cut me off from using the, well, going in the bathroom here. And uh, so anyway, I'm gonna wash my hands. Wash your hands, wash your hands. 
So I didn't point this out on the way up, but look at here, you got the uh, parallel bar station. So I imagine if you could walk around here, this might be the trail, the paw, paw trail that comes around back to the area here. So it wouldn't be a very long trail, I, but I, I wonder if there's stations all along. It probably is. Man, I'm gonna come over here and get a workout tomorrow and uh, cause work on my upper body. I, you know, I'm too tired right now to, to worry about my upper body. I gotta let the lay, I mean, I, I could do that tobacco road trail, but I think I need a day off from hiking and just come here and work on some upper body strength. So maybe we'll spend a day here. I, I don't know if it's paid parking or not, uh, you know, cause all I did was walk in. I mean, if nothing else, I'd park somewhere along the bike trail and just hike in, you know. So anyway. So this is pretty cool. I mean, they got a little amphitheater here at the at the park with the stage, uh, the Bill Leslie stage, town of Cary. And then up here, I think that's a huge uh, like picnic shelter and something to the right of it. Ah, heck, let's hike up there, see what it looks like. So if you didn't want to use the community center bathrooms, it looks like the theater. There's the theater down here. You've got the uh, theater bathrooms up here. I guess this is unisex. So there you go. Yeah, it's unlocked. And then here's your theater center uh, parking lot. And let's see, yeah, this is just a huge picnic area. So boy, you could have like a family gathering here. That looks like it might be a fireplace. Now that would be cool. Bring, uh, bring the family here. Rent out this uh, pavilion, and especially on a day like today when it's just a little bit of a chill on, you know, uh, where's the grills at? Oh, there's a the grill over here. Yeah, you get your charcoal, and uh, well, I guess it looks like you can cook in this fireplace right here, probably with some firewood too. Um, yeah, this would be pretty cool, holding an event here. Nice, uh, nice, nice shelter. Let's head on down. So, don't want to get too close, but look at this uh, children's play area just just up here on the hill with the uh, amphitheater. Because uh, I did see a child playing in there. I can't get their face on the video for sure. And, uh, man, we never had stuff like this when I was a kid. But, you know, what would be cool, you know, if you, if, you know, husband and wife want to come and uh, watch something at the theater, you know, the husband or the wife, whoever, you know, didn't want, they could bring the kids over here and just watch the kids while the spouse uh, enjoys uh you know, uh, whatever, a play on the on the stage or whatever, you know, that, that's always nice. That way you don't have to leave, get a babysitter for the kids. You can just bring them along, you know, because sometimes they're a little bit unruly, you know, when they want to be. And uh, that's uh, that's nice to have that available. So let's get over to the other side of the lake. I, look, there's one of the baseball fields. I think I'm going the wrong dog on direction. So that's fields one through four. Okay. And the lazy, late, lazy days playground. I don't know what that would be like. But I'm more interested in the lake. Let's get back there. So I saw this sign. I'm on my way back to the lake. At least I think I am. What is in the world is autonomous, autonomous vehicle testing. I mean, maybe that's emissions testing. I, I don't know. I, I'd be curious. Leave a comment below if you know what that is. I, I don't know why they'd have it in a park. Whatever that means. All right, let's head on down here. Boy, there's a bunch more buildings down here. I don't know. It's like I got to get going back to 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 watch. Uh, I'm watching uh, on Amazon Prime uh, Reacher. It's just called Reacher, and uh, I've been enjoying it. You know, sometimes uh, these uh, paid services. I, I didn't join Amazon Prime. I had to cut back on expenses. I'm just a member of Netflix right now, and I'm, I'm contributing to that beast. That's the only beast I'm contributing to. I'm not a member of anything else uh, on the TV because. You know, with the wife uh, with being divorced, uh, I'm on a very limited budget at this point in time. Oh, this is the boathouse. Yeah, let's go down and check this out. That's what this is. There's another picnic shelter over here. And I, there's, a, there's another path. I don't know where that goes. Maybe it just goes around, just around the horn here. I, who knows? Like I said, you, I'm not going to spend too much longer here. But I did want to see the boathouse, and I wanted to see that trail on the other side of the lake. And, and that'll be it for the day. So this is the boathouse, uh, April boathouse hours hiring. Boy, I wouldn't mind working here. That would be cool, you know, but a uh, little picnic area. looks like there's picnic tables in here. I can't tell what's in, yeah, picnic tables. It's just a screened in area, which is nice. Uh, here's some more bathrooms. That's good. Uh, and then they got some tables, you know, you could come here and just have a picnic at the boathouse. 
And look at this guy. He's uh, he's chilling out and enjoying it. Let's get a view of the lake here. I'm not going to say anything. I don't want to let him know I'm making a video. Hey, look, I think that, but I'm not sure if that's a dive platform over there or just something else. Well, here's your kayaks that you could rent probably. And we bring your fishing pole and uh, rent one of those and go on out on the lake. And then look, uh, oh, there's a there's an entrance ramp over here where you can put your own boat in. Um, boy, I tell you, wouldn't you love to own these places across the lake there? You know, about what border in a park. So let's uh, let's get going. I'm going to go and get to the trail. There's supposed to be a trail over this way. I'm just going to look at it. I'm not going to hike it. Like I said, I'm oh, there's some. Check this out, man. There's some rocking chairs on the other side here. I just I just spotted them. I don't know if I can get over there or not. I get, I'd have to go through this door right here. Oh, here we go. So there's a guy working on his laptop. But look at this, man. He could come here and just sit in these rocking chairs. <laughs> and then, of course, you've got a view of the kayaks, I, you know. But that, that is cool. And look at these. I guess those are sailboats. It look, looks like to me, man, that'd be fun on a, on a, on a windy day. And uh, I can't tell if, if this is a trail down here or not. I, I don't think it is. Maybe it's just worn in from, from traffic. But let's get to the other side of the lake. So I just got to talk, torturing a gentleman with my mom's story. <laughs> and uh, I shouldn't have done that. Uh, anyway, uh, the, there is a trail actually that goes around the lake. I'm not gonna walk it today. Um, he said it'd take about uh, 35 minutes, maybe, depending on how fast you walk, maybe an hour. And uh, I was thinking about doing it and then just coming around and then taking those stairs down. But instead, what I'm gonna do is just go up here and hike along the top of the uh, the lake and then take those stairs back down to the Greenway. Cause I'm just, I'm too doggone tired to add another another 40 minute hike to the, to the video here. Cause I got a long ways going back. But this is a view of the boathouse from down below. Um, and I, you know, I wanted to show you this beach. I mean, I guess you could bring the kids and, uh, you know, they could play off of this beach maybe. I don't know what it's like in the summertime. I, I, I'm going to get this from the other side. I, I don't know what that is. Uh, and uh, you can see, you know, very nice here. Let's, uh, let's get up here on the, on the mound and uh, start on our way back. Uh, I'm done for the day. I can't wait to, to get back and relax and uh, watch Reacher on Amazon Prime. Peace out. <clears throat> so you got a little tiny boardwalk here at the boathouse and uh, there's, a, there's a sign right there that says fishing area. So I guess uh, if you didn't have a boat, you could just come here and uh, throw some lures in the water here and it doesn't look very deep. Not sure what you would catch off of this. And then here's some ducks. I wanted to get these on the video. Uh, you're not, I mean, of course they got a sign there, don't feed the ducks, but I bet people don't listen to it. You know, but uh, I thought I'd get them. Let's get, let's get up close. Look at that, huh? Pretty cool. There they are. All right, boy, they're beautiful creatures, aren't they? I, there's a, anyway, let's, uh, I'm just gonna bike along this, and then of course there's a little cove, and then we'll get up on top of the hill over here, so.